Hey everybody, I'm Jeffrey Wedig from the Shooting the Resailing podcast over at theescapepods.com. I uh, just wanted to give a shout out to anybody who might be going down to the Annapolis Sailboat Show this coming uh, weekend. Uh, actually, it starts on Thursday, it runs through Monday. I'm going to be there on Saturday and Sunday. I uh, definitely would like to catch up with any of my fans, uh, anybody that listens to my podcast and whatnot. I'm also looking forward to meeting up with a bunch of people that I'm either friends with or have met online, other podcasters and bloggers and YouTubers uh, that are into sailing. Uh, the United States Selva Show in Annapolis is one of the biggest shows around, uh, so we've got a lot of people who are hoping to come in from out of town. I know the hurricane kind of messing up some travel plans through Florida. Luckily uh, for us up here, it doesn't look like today's forecast uh, calls for any imminent threat from the hurricane up this way. Uh, it, all the spaghetti models have it running offshore or kind of twisting back around towards, uh, towards the Bahamas again after it hits Florida. So hopefully it doesn't really hit anybody, but... Uh, I know Tina Clipson from Cruisers TV already posted on Facebook that due to the state of emergency in Florida, she's not going to be able to travel uh, to Annapolis. Um, so there's some other folks, uh, Steve and Brandy from the Sailing Road uh, podcast. Uh, they're hoping to come up. I know they posted a thing on Facebook yesterday saying they may not, you know, they're going to leave it up in the air. That's, they're still planning on being here. They're hoping to be here. Uh, but if things get dicey in Florida, they might have to, uh, to bail out. Uh, but anyway, uh, so on Saturday from 1 to 4, I'm going to be over on the northwest corner of Ego Alley inside the show. So if you know Annapolis downtown, the body of water it comes right up into downtown called Ego Alley. Um, on the street, there's a Starbucks, a bar called Armadillo's, and there's a Mission Barbecue now down where the hardware store used to be. So that's kind of like the corner of the show that I'm talking about. Uh, there's a seawall there. There's usually people selling uh, life rafts and stuff. Uh, a bunch of the tents are over on this side, and then against that back wall uh, are a bunch of vendors. Last year, the Fatty Knees people were in there. Uh, so it's kind of a big enough area to get a couple people standing around talking. It's not going to impede traffic and flow or whatever. There's a place to sit. Uh, there's usually some floating barges uh, with, you know, they're registering people to check out a vacation charters and that sort of thing. Uh, this year, Andy Shell from uh, Five Nine North is going to have his Swan 48 Eastbjorn just on the other seawall, so probably, you know, 150 feet away uh, on display for people to check out and uh, check out their uh, adventure cruises that they run. Um, so anyway, from, from one to four, I'm going to be there. I'd love to catch up with any of you. I'd love to catch up with any of the other uh, people that I'm talking about here. Um, Definitely Kamal from iAndy Boats on YouTube it wants to catch up, and he also was thinking about doing like a meetup over at Pusser's uh, later that day. Uh, he's part of the Universal Sailing Club, so I was talking to Marcus Asante earlier this week, and uh, he said, well, we're already going to be over there, so uh, so you've got different, different places to go in between. They're not really running Cruising World seminars this year. I think Chesapeake Bay Magazine... And the School of Seamanship, I think they're running some seminars. Uh, so, um, you know, it should be a pretty open day. If you've got something going on in the, later in the evening, you can stop by early. If you've got something going on throughout the midday, you can stop by a little bit later. Uh, but definitely check us out. Shoot me a, a line at the escape pods at gmail.com if you want to catch up. Um, <clears throat> there's definitely some other people coming uh, to the show. Paul and Cheryl Shard from Distant Shores are going to be hanging around. There is a seminar, I believe, sponsored by Sail Magazine on Sunday. It's kind of like an all-day event off-site uh, that they will be speaking at. Uh, Andy Shell will be speaking at and a bunch of other people. Uh, also, Charlie Simon from uh, the World Sailing Guru on Facebook. Uh, he's known for doing some Arctic exploration. He's going to be doing some breakfast seminars aboard his boat. Uh, so if you go to Facebook, check him out. You can find out all the times, all that kind of stuff. Uh, Cruising Outpost folks, Bob Bitchin, they're always having a stand back in the back corner by the Marriott. Uh, go check them out. I know Tina from Cruisers TV was planning on being here. She was going to be hanging out with them, but she won't be now since she's not coming. But Lynn Parday is also going to be sort of in that area. Uh, usually she's with SailingChannel.tv, which is Tori Salvia. Uh, they're usually having a booth over by the Gin Barge, which is kind of in that other corner of that show. Uh, she's there. She's going to be promoting Talison's Tales, her new book. 
and then also Voyaging with Kids, which is a book that she helped publish. Uh, so there's definitely going to be people around. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to throw it off to Teddy J from the Sail Loot Podcast. <clears throat> He's got some uh, some words of wisdom for you from uh, the Sail Loot dot com. Welcome to the U.S. Sailboat Show. I hope everybody's having an awesome time, just like I am. My name's Teddy. And I produce the Sail Loot Podcast. You can find the podcast over at sailloot.com. You can probably find it in iTunes if you look for Sail Loot. You can find it in Stitcher if you want to look there. Or any you know Android podcast device, any, anything like that, you can find the Sail Loot Podcast. And basically what I talk about in this podcast is how people afford to go cruising. Everybody come on out. If you see me walking around the sailboat show, feel free to say hello. I probably look something just like uh, you know, this. Introduce yourself. I always like to meet new people. And uh, if you get the chance and you want to check out the podcast, head on over to sailloot.com. All right. Thanks, Teddy. And uh, we'll see you at the sailboat show on this weekend. Like I said, everybody wants to stop by, check us out. Uh, shake hands, say hi, whatever. Uh, please do so. Like I said, uh, the escape pods at gmail.com. Shoot me a line. And uh, I'll hope to get some, some good interviews this weekend. Uh, like I said, I hope I can be there Monday too. Usually the show calms down a little bit and I get some more free time to actually interview some people. Uh, but we'll see what happens. It looks like it's going to be a great time. Can't wait to see it. And uh, sail on, brother.